Ascot on Gold Cup Day, a midsummer setting for high fashion and top class racing. Yes, it's Ladies' Day, and striking creations bring the garden party atmosphere to this lovely Berkshire course. And again, the Queen and Prince Philip acknowledge the cheers as they make the traditional drive down the course. A link here with the past, for it was Queen Anne who first rode over from Windsor to launch her new meeting. And for over two centuries, the new season's fashions have graced the well-kept lawns, adding feminine charm to the sport of kings. A royal visit to the paddock, though Her Majesty has yet to be represented in the long-distance classic. The Queen is wearing a lace embroidered dress with a fur and a fashionable close fitting hat. Princess Margaret has a white shantung dress with a little cap of pink rose petals and a veil. Princess Alexandra of Kent is with the royal party as they leave the paddock and mingle with a vast crowd. Royalty enjoying a day at the races. There's the Duchess of Kent. Now the 11 thoroughbreds parade for the Gold Cup and we take another look at fashions with a focus this time on hats. Here are the finishing moments of a six-horse French challenge for the coveted trophy and royal excitement that was to be repeated when Landau and Oriol brought off a royal double. There's Silex, number three for France, leading from Elpenor, number one, who is making a challenge on the outside. Side by side, they battle it out down the straight. Two gallant stairs sharing a photo finish for France. The final result goes to Elpenor by a short head. A first season training success for our old friend Charlie Elliott, who rode the winner last year.